there will be some loud explosions. It's going to be scary. Okay? So if you're anxiety prone from loud noises, you may not want to stay in here. Does everybody have a balloon? Yes. Yeah. All right, the tongs are here. I'm scared, man. You should, have your, you should have yours. I just grabbed one to put over there. One at a time. I'm scared. Who's first? Who's first? I'm the first. All right. Watch out the cord. Oh, you're going to do it right in front of oh. 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 That's my right? Uh, we will pick up balloon guts afterwards. Let's go. Can I use your tongue? Oh, oh my camera, please. Oh, Lord. That, that like made like a whole like movie type explosion right there. <laughs> Wait, can you hold my phone when I go up? All right. I should have made mine bigger. You can go. What did you say? I'm not even trying to Oh, Jesus. All right, stop for just a moment. Listen up. Why are we hearing the explosion? Hydrogen is popping. Because hydrogen is flammable. Anybody in here heard the Hindenburg before? What's the Hindenburg? Hindenburg murder? was a great big dirigible, a blimp. It was filled with hydrogen gas, which is what made it float. Simeon pointed out the fact that when they throw it up in the air, it's very lightweight feeling. That's because it's hydrogen. It felt it should feel much heavier than you blowing it up with carbon dioxide. I was trying to create a balloon big enough that would actually float because the sizes that we have aren't quite enough to float because the hydrogen isn't enough to outweigh the weight of the balloon. So it's not floating. But the reason we're hearing this is because you because hydrogen is extremely flammable. You're actually making water doing this lab. Right. The very last water. equation, you're taking hydrogen gas and combusting it, <clears throat> blowing it up. Now we talk about a, a true combustion reaction is carbon dioxide and water in the end. We're not getting carbon dioxide this time, but this is a type of combustion reaction. You are taking hydrogen gas, you are burning it in the presence of oxygen, and what do you get when you burn hydrogen and oxygen together? You get water vapor. Next. Who's next? <coughs> I saw one now. Wait, what you want me to do that one for you? I'll do it. I'll do it. I want to do it. I mean, okay, move. Right. What's that so cute? You are. Okay. That's me. You like. Tell me why that one sounded different. Because I blew it up with my breath. That was carbon dioxide. So if you didn't have hydrogen, 
it wasn't going to be a big explosion. The reason you heard the louder noise in the other balloons is because you had hydrogen, which is an extremely flammable gas. We had carbon monoxide in the last one, so it just melted the balloon and that was it. Question, are there any other balloons out there? Are we done with all of them? All right, what I need you to do is I need somebody, a lot of you, several of you, clean up the balloon corpse.